Dun 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 Hello and welcome to the Rick and Jack Show. My name is Rick. No. No it isn't. My name is Rick. My name is Jack. And today we're going to be talking about the Olympics. London 2012. An exciting event for all Londoners. Yeah. No. But if you're, if, you're, if you're just a normal Londoner and you need to get about, it's going to be a roid pain. A roid pain. A roid pain. There's going to be people everywhere going, oh hey, I'm going to the Olympics. And there's going to be like everyone on the train. The is, there's probably people coming that aren't even going to the Olympics. They're just going to be here to be a pain. Travel stoppers. Is that what they're called? I don't know, probably. That's a rubbish name. I remember when we, when we got it, I was at school, and we was all allowed to sit around the, the big projector. And it was like, and the Olympics goes to London! And everyone went, yeah! I don't remember this. I, was I in, don't know what lesson I was in. I was in DT. Oh, I wasn't in DT, I was in someone else. Something where we actually learn. We learn in DT. Not on that day. You didn't. How to make things out of wood. I had to watch the. I had to draw. I had to draw perfect squares. How to watch us get the Olympics. Yeah, that was, <laughs> that's, that's what we were. That's what we learned that day. How to beat the French. So, what event are you most looking forward to? I'm not looking forward to anyone because I don't really care. <laughs> <laughs> to put it bluntly. All right. What event do you think you'd be good at? Then? None of them. Fat people don't enter the Olympics for a reason. None of them at all. Wrestling. But then it's not proper, well, no, it is proper wrestling. If it was like... <laughs> it's proper wrestling. Yeah. The wrestling you're thinking of isn't. I'd be going in there going, let's get on, brother! And I'd be like trying to choke slam people. Yeah, and they'd be like... But they, I'd get disqualified straight away. Fault! <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, man! It's like sumo wrestling without the sumos. Mm. i go E Honda on them. Thousand hand slap. You can do it like that. Oh, I'd do it like that. Oh, that's rubbish. Thousand hand bitch slap. Thousand <laughs> hand pimp slap. <laughs> Yo ho! Okay, so what event do you think you'd be worst at? Hurdles. Uh, <laughs> I can't run and jump. I can barely run, let alone run and run jump. Run and jump. I think, I think the steeplechase is like hurdles, but with obstacles. Like there's like a water pit. That's after the hurdle? No, I just. I'd so you'd run, be out of breath, jump, fall in that, and then drown? I'd break. You'd break? <laughs> Not a specific part, I would just All break. Of you, you'd just completely break. Like if you drop a glass. That's what would happen to me. <laughs> I'd jump a hurdle and just psh, on the Except floor. In front of millions of people. Yeah, it'd be, it'd be terribly embarrassing. Mm. Okay, so are there any events you think should be events? Yes. They don't have to necessarily be sports. Getting your sofa, a new sofa, into your living room <laughs> event. 100 metres. Without. 100 metres sofa. You've got to run from a van that is parked 100 <laughs> metres away from your house with a sofa in your hands. You can have like a partner. It could be like sort of like a, a dual event. Um, and you have to get it into that <laughs> tight squeeze. Yeah, that's a good one. I think a good one is the 100 metre walk to the bathroom in the dark and they'll put loads of obstacles down like plugs facing the wrong way, <laughs> Lego blocks. So you can tread on it and you've got to not make a noise. So if you do it and you go, <laughs> you're out. <laughs> but if you tread on it and go, then that's fine. <laughs> as long as you don't make a noise and the winner is the person who gets to the end. First, first. in the shortest amount of time yeah. with making least noise. And there's a person on a bed on a rail, and as you're walking, it goes with you. So if there's like an umpire in a bed, so when you make a noise, they wake up with a flag, and go, no, <laughs> straight away. <laughs> People should leave leave Lego bricks on like the gymnast's bald bit. Ooh, on so the balance beam. And they're doing cartwheels. Yeah. <laughs> I'd watch it then. They should do an event where you've got to build something, a like Lego, but it's not like you've got a Lego kit where you build something specifically. It's just you've got a box of Lego and the winner is the one who builds the best thing. <laughs> I'd always put like a house and I'd be like, that's a bit boring. And I'd put wheels on it. <laughs> I've got a house on wheels. I'd build the Death Star. But with like a McDonald's on top of but, it. No, but they're not all the same colour, all the bricks you get. They're all like... That's fine then. It'd be like a rainbow Death Star. <laughs> with a rainbow Darth Vader. With bills. 
and the McDonald's M on the top. They'd like that because McDonald's are a sponsor. How can McDonald's be a sponsor for the Olympics? <laughs> I want to know. Now, I didn't research this, so I could be totally wrong. Right. Why have we got the little plastic gun? Because uh, we're not allowed guns here. But the little, like... Yeah, it's, it's just little... like... It doesn't shoot anything. Well, it just makes that's noise. rubbish. Yeah, I know. Yeah. I reckon it's because it's in East London and mm -hmm. that's notorious for gunshots going on. <gasps> they reckon they'd set off riots. <laughs> we should have like a coliseum and turn the Olympic Games into a battle to the death. Each country has a representative. No, loads of representatives. It'd be over in like a day. Yeah, 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 loads of representatives. Like a hundred free. And they're different types people. of battles. Ones with an axe. Yeah, there's a sea battle. What they do in the sea. Ones a with a, a ones, naval battle. The ones with a, with a javelin. Chariots. Shot puts. Cannons. Shot puts. Yeah. But you just go up. You see only one shit at someone. It's the only weapon you've got. It's <laughs> <laughs> the only way you can attack. A battle people. royale with Olympic <laughs> event weapons. So you could have a javelin on a horse from the equestrian event. <laughs> doing <laughs> dressage. But you're like, <laughs> and just throw a spear at someone. <laughs> So what do you think of the Olympics? Do you think they're a good thing, a bad thing? Do you think we should be in them, maybe? I think it'd be funny. For who? <laughs> For everyone. Everyone except yeah. us. <laughs> we wouldn't be winning any, any medals, let's put it that way. We wouldn't be winning anything. So yeah, tell I us. I think the big few questions as to how we qualified. Yeah, that's true. As you were saying. <laughs> yeah, so tell us what you think down here. Down, down here. And if you'd, uh, if you'd be so kind, you could... Um, you had, uh, what's your, <clears throat> so, I don't know, yeah, so, thanks again for watching, and we'll see you next week. Bye-bye. Oh, yeah.